when I first moved there, I had to hold the toilet seat down because it wasn't fixed. And I was told, oh, now you have company that that's why you want your toilet seat fixed. I said, no, it should have been fixed when I first moved there, not because I was having company. The issues that I'm having is that the roaches are everywhere um, in the refrigerator, on the stove. I've had them climb on me. Um, bath time when I'm trying to eat. I've had them crawl in my ears before. The mice, uh, I don't see them that often, but I caught two of them last night. A lot of them come in the middle of the night or in the morning when I have to be brave and take them out myself because it's too late to knock on his door. Man, um, every time I tell my landlord I've seen them on the stove, he's like, on the stove? I said, of course, I've seen them climb. So he doesn't believe me. So your landlord, uh, what, he doesn't take you seriously? Um, not all the time. He doesn't laugh, but he takes his time getting things when I tell him that something is there. The conditions have gone on repaired in my apartment. Um, it's under the bathroom sink, I mean under the kitchen sink, and under the cupboard. There are holes, and there's a crack behind the radiator that's in my room. Um, the wall in the bathroom was badly torn that I didn't even want to touch. It looked like I was going to fall off. I hate coming home due to that. I spend more time at people's houses instead of my own, and I'm like, I feel bad paying rent, and I don't even stay home half of the time. It annoys me. Since you've been living there and under these conditions, has your rent increased? My rent was first $6.95, then it went up to $7.35. Then they tried to raise it to $7.50, and I was trying to figure out what happened to the 20s and the 30s. I was told, because of a parking space, I don't even have a car. I don't think they should charge people for um, a parking space like that. They should ask if you have a car instead of just charging you for a space you don't use. My mom and my sister and I got together and wrote a couple of notices and we made copies, gave one to him and the residential manager. And I'm still having issues up to now. Tell me about what happened when you started handing out flyers to the other residents. Okay, I was passing out the flyers, trying to get people together. And I was down the hallway by the time the resident manager caught me. When I went to work the next day, the owner, William Senak, um, called me at work on my cell phone and indicated to me that I couldn't pass out the flyers. He suggested that I don't pass them out. So I think I only passed out three and I had to stop. But um, I haven't been late with my rent, so they can't kick me out.